What's up, my beer bros? Beer Maniac here with another special video. We're doing a video that we used to do over 200 videos ago on my channel where we would do a free game every now and then on the PSN store. Just been really busy with Horizon after it came out. That series has died down. The interest is down, obviously. So I figured, why not kick it back old school to one of the things that started this channel out and got me some of my first subscribers, which is review the free games on the PSN. And right now we have one called Clicker Heroes. And I used to play this game on my phone all the time. It's amazing. You can see the little rat guy down there. I will explain how this game goes. And it's probably just going to be a one-off video so don't expect too much more but I'm also in the process of getting disc jam free on the PSN currently I believe for the next couple weeks also so if you get a chance go check that out there's not going to be any link in the description down below but it's on the PSN store for free for PlayStation Plus members I believe for the next two weeks until April 7th I think you anyway, guys if you do enjoy videos like these and you want to see little small games like that, let me know in the comment section down below. If you are new and enjoy stuff like this, don't forget to subscribe. I do Overwatch, Destiny, and right now Horizon content and stuff like that. And there will be plenty more games to come. Also, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. It will help. It will show me your interest. And, hey, you know, the more people like stuff like this, the more I'll do stuff like this. If you want to see something else, just eh, let me know. You know, guys... I will get into the video in just a second. Right now, I'm, I'm figuring out the controls as I go to R1 and L1 is to switch between your, obviously your heroes, your achievements, and stuff like that. You can see different things. Reach 1,000 billion DPS. The old statistic menu that most idle games will have, which I love. You can also use the direction pad for that. And it looks like you just click square to attack the monster. Sounds like I'm just slapping him. He squeaked. Do it really fast. Use some of your video gamer skills. Use that video gamer thumb. Okay, we got five gold, so we purchase this. Which means my... Oh yeah, my clicks do more damage. Okay, I... okay there it is. That was an over-sexualized cat monster, and it was kind of creepy. Okay, now we do... Three. I have no idea what the fuck that is. That's kind of cool. Right there, what the fuck is that? What the fu what the fuck is that? Is this a just a bunch of furries? Did a bunch of furries create this game? I love that, though. Angry potato. Let's see if we can find anything cool. We got a stump with a leaf stick. We got a cool spider with a. Oh, that art detail in that spider is amazing. I like the back of it. Let's go over here and upgrade that real quick. We got another gloop. I might, um. Fast forward ahead to where we make a little bit more progress. Okay, guys, I will see you. In the next world. As you can see here, we're making quite some progress quite quickly, I might I might think. As you can see, we also got a few achievements. By a few, I mean like two. <laughs> we can see our statistics have grown a little bit. We got some more in Heroes Unlocked. That's one reason why I wanted to show you this. Sorry, it's hard, hard to tell where I am. We got unlocked the Tree Beast. Drunken Brawler, Princess, Wandering Fisherman, and Betty Clicker. Now, I remember from the mobile app, I don't know if this is the same, but the Betty Clicker helps, like, her abilities, as you can see right here with the highlighted check marks. They help boost the other hero's DPSs, so she's critical to success. Like, when you ascend and get hero souls, boosting her helps quite a bit. And you can see here... Now, this game, as you can see at the bottom, your purchase contributes to contributes to the continued development of this game. And the maker is saying thank you. So what you can do is buy these jewels. It's like $2 for 20 or something like that. So if you want to get instant refresh, boom. Just drop a couple bucks, help them out. Or if you want to like help them out a lot, you can drop like 40 and get like uber thousands or whatever. And it gives you like gilded heroes, it can be top tier gilded heroes. 
Like, just insane. And they're always gilded, no matter how many times you ascend. They will remain gilded, so it's not a wasted purchase whatsoever. Then you got hero souls you can use for special perks. You can double your DPS forever, so if you want some fast progress and you don't like starting too slow, get that. Definitely consider buying this if you're into these kind of games, because it helps out the creator and it can help them make this game a better experience. Also, you can see my skill bar right here on the side, on the left. I've only lost a couple skills, but this one right here, I'll show you in a second. I'm going to count down. It's going to do auto-tapping for 10 clicks per second for 30 seconds. Now, as you can see, I just have... I'm going to switch the map a little quick. You can see it's taking a little while for my DPS idol or heroes to kill them. But once I click this perk... You can just hear the ass slap. Just listen to those ass slaps. It's insane. Oh, this game is so fun. Anyway, guys, I'm going to try to unlock a few more abilities, and I'll show you how those work. Also, I'll show you once, like, the world's changing shit and how that works. And we might end the video soon after that. Who knows? I just want to go into detail a little bit more about the different characters and what they do. So... Please bear with me, stay tuned. Finally guys, I have unlocked another ability called Power Surge. What it does is it does another 100% DPS, DPS for 30 seconds with another cooldown of 10 minutes. These two are really good if you want to get over the cliff of a boss fight. Just bam, some click storm, bam, Power Surge, bam, lucky strikes. Yeah. That helps. That come that combined with Clickstorm is amazing. I know that from personal experience when I played it on my phone. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna show you just how potent it is. As you can see, you look at this King Deviled Crab, looking like some freaky shit. Let me upgrade some heroes real quick. As you can see, roughly. Actually, let's just start over the fight. It starts with a 30-second fight. You can see we do roughly 179,000 DPS, give or take a couple hundred. And at 30 seconds, that should do about 480, 490,000, somewhere around there, maybe 500,000 health. So as you can see, he's going to die. Not much time left. First, let me upgrade another hero to make it so he dies quicker. And it's not going down too fast. Let's wait until he dies one more time, and then I'll show you the true power of this thing. <laughs> It's really good for farming gold on bosses, like the easier bosses, not so much the current bosses that you're on. And we activated it. Now, it doesn't look like it's doing much, but it's about 9 seconds left to add before, about 10. Either way, now you only, you say you cut your time and basically have. Combine it with a couple of upgrades. Or combine it on like a map area here. And boom. As you can see, you can clear the tougher paths quite well. Let me get rid of that real quick. And as you can see, I haven't earned any more hero souls yet. I've been at this game for about an hour and a half now. And as you can see, actually what I was going to tell you, um, you can see the world changed. Instead of fighting in the desert like I started, we're fighting some flamingo goes with exercise socks for some reason. Some Turtloid Warlocks, and we're on like a piratey plank, which is kind of cool. I, the, I like the themes throughout the levels, but like I said, guys, I stress, I stress enough. This game's like a hundred megabyte download. It takes up virtually no space. You don't even have to fucking play it for five hours straight. You can just play it for ten minutes when you have time, waiting for something to cook, waiting for someone's youtube video to come out per se like mine even though nobody waits for mine one day someone will wait for mine now and um it's just a fun little game to pass the time kind of like um adventure capitalist was when i did a video on that before and before i end this video i do want to say congratulations on or congratulations on this game to the company that made this off the top of my head, I can't think about it, but when this tweet goes out, I'll probably tag them in it or send them a tweet personally. Because this game, the way it's set up to me, yes, there's a lot of idle games 
but it's still in a way inventive and for them to do like an idle game like this and to get it out on the PS4 now I can't really name any other idle games that are like this on the PS4 and I love idle games but I don't love when my phone dies or drains battery constantly from these idle games all the time and all the ads I have to watch from them too so the fact that I can play on my PS4 it makes me ecstatic like hopefully if if this channel ever does grow and it ever does make anything of itself hopefully one day I can help like not necessarily be sponsored by a smaller game like this but to like bring it to attention and make it so like other people are like oh holy shit this game is fun and I kind of wanted that too with this jam but everyone else already knows that game's fun that game's been touched all over by cartoon and delirious and ohm wrecker and them so the words already out there but I feel like this game's a little more hidden but it's definitely worth a shot so if you do have a ps4 try it it's fun I'm not even sure if you even need PS plus for this you could just probably get it I don't know if it's on the ps3 also but you could probably get this and I recommend trying it if you're into that kind of thing but if you're not into idle gamers I do not stress it enough probably don't bother trying it because this is not gonna be your thing because like I said I've been grinding for an hour and a half and I've barely made any progress so unless you have time to pass it's probably not going to be a good experience for you. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it so much. Like I said before in the beginning of the video, subscribe if you are new. Leave a like down below. It will help a great deal. I'm not asking, oh, I want like 100 likes, 10 likes, or whatever. Just if you're interested in something like this, just let me know by leaving a like or let me know by leaving a comment. Either way, it's fine. And thank you guys for rambling. Um, little notice though um there should be a final preparation nightfall strike video coming up later this week i'm not sure if it'll be later today or wednesday or something like that but we're getting ready for the daybreak for the new destiny update coming out so hopefully maybe we can do a couple carries find someone to do that so we can maybe make a daybreak carry tuesdays or something like that who knows Anyway guys, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.